Well, Donald Trump's criminal trial is heading into the final stretch. Star witness Michael Cohen returns to the stand later on today for more cross-examination before the former president's lawyers present their case. Sources say the jury could hear closing arguments this week. So joining us now from just outside of the courthouse, CBS News investigative reporter Graham Cates. All right, Graham, so Michael Cohen is back on the stand again. Cross-examination began last week. What's likely to happen today? What are we likely to hear? You know, after uh, some seven hours of withering cross-examination, challenging Cohen's credibility, honesty, and motivations, uh, defense attorney Todd Blitz has said he has about an hour is left of uh, questions, and then prosecutors have a few more of their own, but then they're expected to rest their case. So the, ca the case does appear to be sort of wrapping up. Um, it's assumed that Donald Trump's not going to be testifying. Who else is going to be taking the stand then? Who are the potential witnesses for the defense? You know, they haven't actually said that for sure in court that he won't be, but um, mm. they've talked about also calling potentially an expert witness. It's a former FEC commissioner named Bradley Smith. Even uh, as, as recently as Thursday, though, they weren't sure if they were going to call him because before the trial, the judge put out an order se uh, severely restricting what Smith can talk about. He's not allowed to, for instance, give opinions on the law. Uh, and so they may call him. They kind of indicated they will, but they haven't said it affirmatively in court. Uh, and then um, we, we, the judge believes that we're moving closer to closing arguments. That would be um, as early as tomorrow. All right. Ought to be another interesting day in court. Graham Cates, thank you.